It had to be walking this way. You see it? Dixon, it comes at me. You watch where you shoot that thing, okay? Hey everybody, Cypher Boy here with the game The Walking Dead Survival Extinct where you play as Daryl Dixon. I think I see some blood. Is there blood always this black? If you ever go into my pro video description, I have my fanfiction.net profile listed there and that there's Buck up ahead he's signaling cut through the trees to see what he wants and that profile has my walking dead fan fiction called the Dixon clan and it follows the adventure of Connor Dixon which is Daryl's son in my world and then Brent and Steve Dixon, who are Morrow's sons. Uh, I didn't crouch down, so I might have made too much noise. Best you crouch to keep quiet. Busted up. Nothing can be done now except ease his suffering. <laughs> Sorry, brother. Okay, now it's time to go around, pick up everything I can find. And hope for the best, because this game always gives me anxiety with how fast paced it is and you have to kill zombies and they surround you. Daryl, come here. We gotta work up a plan.
like. Come here. I heard you the first time. Time to. We gotta work up a plan. Daryl, come here. I'm working on it. Come on. Then. Okay, just shut you up. We gotta work Have up you ever a seen plan. Anything like that? If you told me about it, I'd call you a liar. Listen. There's more of them coming. We gotta go. Yeah, the only thing we gotta do is kill every last one of them. Daryl, I know you're upset, but just listen. That sounds like a whole lot of them. We need to go now. Gather up as much as you can and meet me at the truck. Let's go then. Daryl, remember what we learned about them. Head trauma. Attack the brain. Remember, only thing we know that kills them. And be quiet sneaking out the back door. Don't let them see you. Put on it. Still too loud. Okay, hope that helps. <clears throat> okay, so. Anyways, other games with monsters I don't have issues with. It's just zombies for some reason. Oh. Okay, that's good to. How are you doing? Push ups? Oh, he's gone now. Okay, let's go this way. Okay. Let's go ahead and get rid of this one real quick. There we go. Okay, now that I know how to execute them properly, I kept struggling before. I, this should be a tiny bit easier. Bye-bye. Okay, let's move the mic closer to me so I can sit back more comfortably. in here besides the fuel. I'm looking for you. Nope. Crouch slow. Okay, time to equip the glass bottle. I think there is fuel this way. Yeah, here's one. Try to avoid them as much as possible. Okay, there we go. Grab the last bottle here.
Okay, so I think it's time to equip the knife again. Since Jess, which I think is might be Daryl's uncle, is the his I'm trying to get into there. So let's make a spread for it. And avoid this as many as I can. up again. Okay, so let's Oops. Pick that up. Here, let's equip the knife again. If I can get them coming at me, like this one here. <laughs> That's one down. That would be cool if you can like level up in this game. Okay, that's... Okay, that's three down. So that should make it easier to get to the truck. How many is that? There's, I think there's three more. Um, maybe four, five. I'm trying to get one of them to notice me so I can. Maybe explore this part a little bit. Okay, that one saw me. I'm pretty sure there's no one behind me, so that's... There we go. <clears throat> Any more that way? Get a move on, Daryl! I'll go at my own pace. No need to hurry. You're not going to get into the truck, so you're still safe. There we go. Okay, that one sees me now. So I think after he is down, I can get to the truck a lot safer. There we go. So let's check over here and make sure there's nothing I can take with me. That's where I came out of and went that way. Okay, so I don't see anything else. And there it looks like there's um three of them left. So I can read up. There we go. Oidable complex. I don't know what that means. 
Here you can select your next destination and how to move there. Back roads consume more fuel but provide additional scavenging opportunities while taking highways so conserves fuel but bypass scavenging opportunities. Um, let's see. Sedalia, let's do back roads. Not a damn thing. My phone ain't working either. Hey, about your dad? I don't know what to say about it. Then don't. Leave it be. And we gotta tell Merle what happened. Yeah, I suppose we do. But we ought to warn people first. What? Go to the cops? <sighs> Please. We gotta go get Merle. <laughs> Merle, he's... Well, he's just not right. What you say to me, old man? Merle's ten times the man you are. All right, all right. Just seems you boys turn hay into shit when you're together. driving through that. We're on foot from here. Ah, boy. Bet them psychos came here, too. Yeah, maybe. Town circled their wagons, you see. Looks like a DMZ. If there's any gas, it'll be at Lucky's. Come on up here and talk a minute. Use the ladder. You're at the dumpster. Hey, man, up here. Not nice set up. Jimmy Blake, last standing officer of the Sedalia SO. Go for you. There's cycles all over this place, too. The biters? Yeah, they're everywhere, man. Where have you been? Up in the hills, hunting. Didn't know nothing about them until they tore up our camp. Still don't. Uh-huh. Let me bring you up to speed. More of them come every day. 
We help each other survive, or we don't. That's it. Normal rules suspended for the foreseeable future. That a 